Hello. Today I will explain the setting grey listing within Spam Titan. Please note grey listing can be enabled and disabled on our Spam Titan private cloud and our Spam Titan gateway product. In our Spam Titan shared cloud environment, grey listing is disabled. So to enable grey listing, you go to System Setup, Mail Relay, Grey Listing. It is disabled by default, so simply click Enable. The way grey listing works is when a mail comes into Spam Titan, it is sent back to the sending mail server for re-delivery after a set period of time. By default, the set period of time in Spam Titan is 5 minutes or 300 seconds. This means if the sending mail server tries to re-deliver the mail immediately, we will send it back again as it must wait the allotted period of time. You can change this wait period from this tab Beside this setting, mail delay in seconds. You can change this to whatever wait time you wish. This is very effective as most spam senders will not re-deliver the mail. They will send it once and they will not requeue the mail. Grey listing looks for three settings. The sending IP address, the sender email address, and the recipient email address. Once we see those five times, that sender is then exempt from grey listing, so they will not be sent back to the mail server after those five times. This again can be changed and lowered or raised beside this setting, the auto whitelist client. As you can see, it is set to five by default. If you have senders or recipients that you would like to bypass grey listing straight away, once enabled, you can add the sender's IP address to the client IP exemptions. If a recipient domain or email address would, does not want any of their mail grey listed, simply add their domain or that email address to the recipient email exemptions. Yeah.